Okay, hello again. This is the interior uh, view of our Sonic Light SL169VUD camper that I'm putting up for sale. Um, these uh, steps, I'll point out in, uh, first, they uh, fold up into the camper um, when you're not using them. They're, they're a rather nice feature that we've enjoyed. Uh, the screen door um, has got its uh, it's got the screenshot is what they call it. And if you'll just let go of it, it will close on its own, um, which is a real nice feature. Um, so let's step inside. Uh, Sonic Light gives you this hand grab, which is great. On the right side, there is a queen bed, queen size bed and um, full queen. That quilt actually came with the camper. A uh, couple lights there above the bed. You got a USB. Uh, two USB outlets on the left and uh, 110 outlet on the right. Uh, you've got uh, shelves up top. Uh, owner's manuals are all in that brown folder. And looking to the right, you've also got this uh, this shelf, this uh, the storage. It's got a coat rack in it. Uh, we we found that this works better for us, um, but that's easily removed. This shelf. Um, it's got a Bluetooth stereo. I'm sorry, yeah, Bluetooth stereo with a, um, a DVD player. Um, so that's been a nice feature for rainy nights. Uh, we also have a television in this unit. It's got a, both units have a remote. Um, uh, so yeah, you got a TV here. Uh, moving around to, the, to my left, uh, you've got the dining area, which would easily seat four adults and, you know, maybe five to six um combination of smaller people and and adults this is the slide out um that uh, you see from the outside and video number one moving to the back uh this unit has bunk beds so single bunk beds um i as i mentioned or i may have mentioned uh the unit has an outdoor shower this here is a outdoor shower tent so we bought it, we never used it. It was for an event that uh, was canceled due to COVID. Uh, so we, um, we never did use it, but that's included in this as well with this camper. Uh, I also mentioned that we have a solar panel kit and here it is, a Renology. Uh, I believe it's 100 watt, although it may be 80 watt, uh, but it's a, it's a solar panel kit that connects to the battery and so you can, you can go off the grid. Uh, here is the thermostat for the unit. So it's got, uh, it's got a furnace, it's got an air conditioner. Um, also Venture RV, who is the manufacturer of Sonic Light. Uh, they have this app uh, here that uh, it's a leveling system. You get an app on your phone and you can determine how level your camper is um, when, when you back in and camp. On to the bathroom. So there's a toilet and um, the sink area is here. Your controls for your water heater uh, and water pump are here. Uh, you know, that's also where you get your indication as to how full your tanks are. And uh, sink basin here, uh, shower here. So this is not what they call a wet bath, but this is a standalone shower that you can just close these curtains and you don't get the whole wet space wet like some campers. Uh, and this also has a skylight. So you're, uh, you know, it's got pretty good head clearance. Um, stepping out of the bathroom and into the kitchen area, it's, this unit has a pretty large uh, freezer refrigerator combo from Norcold. Um, and these have served us well. Um, you've got a, a fan a light unit, two burner stove from Suburban, a microwave oven um, with a convection oven. So that's, that's a nice feature to have. And then the fuse box is down there. Um, we are including a bunch of cookware uh, from GSI plates. Uh, pots and pans in this kit, uh, some pretty pretty decent stuff. So you you could you could buy this today and go camping tonight. Some other plates and a teapot, that sort of thing. Um, so all kinds of fun stuff in there. Um, sink area, pretty big sink, pretty deep sink. 
and drawers. Uh, there's silverware in those drawers that we'll throw in. Uh, here is the, I guess it's called a safe. You can hang your keys uh, here. Uh, the awning controls are here. The light controls are here. And there's uh, some USB and 110 outlets in here. Okay, so that's the, that's the tour of the camper. Um, if you're interested, please let me know. I live in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Um, the camper itself is stored in nearby Bloomington, Minnesota. And uh, again, uh, in the ad, I'll have my contact information uh, and the price. Thanks for watching.